What's up Cherry Blossom family and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in today. So today is a very, very long overdue video, something that I had intended on doing back in Vlogmas in December and it just kind of never happened and I owe an apology to all of you guys because today we're gonna open some very, very overdue <laughs> magic mail, like really, really overdue and I like to call this pixie dusted parcels just because it's a little way for you guys to sprinkle pixie dust on my life. And thank you so much from the bottom of my heart for everyone who has sent something to me. It's definitely not something that is required, um, but I, I do really appreciate it. So thank you. Thank you very much. So I am going to start with this box. So this is a little box and I like tried to put a Mickey on it. It's kind of sad. I need to redo it in the Little Mermaid sequence. But in this box, I have been collecting mail for probably the last few months, if not longer. And so I want to go through this box and then I have several parcels off to my side that are kind of larger boxes that we are going to go through. So let's open some of these pixie dusted parcels. So this is from Claudine from Michigan and it says cheers for all the magic that lies ahead. Oh, I love that. Ooh, an iron on patch. <gasps> Cute. Okay, so we have like a little mystery iron on patch. We'll open that in just a moment, but I'm going to read the card. Um, I totally love watching your YouTube channel. I feel um, like you're a friend. Oh, I love that. Oh, so sweet. So I don't want to read the whole thing. It's a little bit personal. Um, but basically she said that she went and bought three of these and she got two Mikos. So it looks like Miko is a part, is what is inside here. And the card is the Ariel Designer Collection, which I think is so pretty. And then, oh yes, oh, this is super cute. So here is Miko. Oh, adorable. Yay, thank you so much. This is gonna go into my chair, my uh, patch chair. I've been talking about that tweed chair since I started this channel, so we're gonna have to work on that together. I need to put that on my list of things to do. The next thing I got is a postcard, and this is a postcard. It's actually an original sketch of Ariel. This is from Joy and Leanne. It says, I love your channel. It makes me so happy to watch. Thank you for sharing. Oh, I love that. Thank you. This is so cool. I love seeing these original sketches. I have had another person send me the Ursula one, which was really, really neat. Um, so I really appreciate that. Thank you. And also, guys, just so you know, I take all of these cards and I have them in a shoebox right now. I save them all and I am going to be making a scrapbook very soon of all of the things that you guys have sent me over the last two years, which is I definitely hang on to it because it's very sweet of you. Okay, so the next is from Nicole from Indiana. Oh, I know who this is. <laughs> oh, this is so cool. So Nicole is from Irresistible Magic. And I will link her channel down below. Uh, there's a lot of confetti in this card. It is a Christmas card and it ha features Ducky and Bunny. And Nicole is a very, very, very talented artist and she has made cards for me in the past. She's made, uh, val last year for Valentine's Day, she made me a King Triton card. Um, she's just super duper talented. So it says, Merry Christmas to you and your guy. May it be filled with joy and happiness that lasts throughout the year. Thank you for sharing your trips, awesome crafts, and giggles with us. May you always have reasons to smile and hope in your heart. Merry Christmas, Nicole. Oh, thanks, Nicole. <laughs> I really appreciate that. That's super sweet. And then here is the card. And yes, she drew that ducky and bunny which is pretty incredible so nice work Nicole you are so talented and I love seeing what you come up with it's pretty amazing you're a very very inspirational person because I've always wanted to be able to draw better than I do now not saying I'm good at drawing it's definitely not the case um, but I've always wanted to be really good at drawing never really happened. So this is from Michelle from New Jersey and I have a feeling this is another Ooh, this is beautiful oh it's a Thomas Kincaid oh my gosh this is so nice it is a Christmas card guys 
look at that image and it's got like this iridescent glitter on it and Mickey and Minnie ice skating oh my gosh that's stunning it says hi Jesse I'm one with the four Disney named cats oh yes oh my gosh I remember talking to you um, hope all is well. Love your gingerbread house contest. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> if you guys haven't seen the gingerbread house contest, um, we've had it too on our channel. It's a tradition every year and I lost so bad to like in 2018. In 2019, I actually won with my figment house. Yes. I was so proud of myself. Um, anyway, <laughs> Um, oh, she says, it's a shame all of the rain that you had in Tokyo Disney. Yeah, it's just an excuse to go back, I feel. Um, have a happy and healthy new year. Well, I hope that for you too. Uh, Michelle, thank you so much. This is so sweet. <laughs> oh man, yeah, all of the rain. All of the rain in Tokyo. But honestly, I like wouldn't trade it for the world. That was such a monumental like time in my life. Like I'm like, I had been dreaming of going to Japan for so long that like nothing was gonna literally <laughs> rain on my parade and we ended up getting to do a lot of things that we really wanted to do. Um, it would have been nice not to have the rain, that's for sure, but it, it still was pretty amazing. Oh, this is from Jassim. So if you, um, so Jassim just started a channel. He's also got an amazing Instagram. I'm gonna link them down below, but it looks like he wrote me a card. He is so sweet. We talk all the time on Instagram. And let's see what he said. Ooh, this is cute. Oh, it looks like a um, like a little postcard. Oh, it says, may your days be merry and bright. And it looks like a stamp. That's so pretty. Wow, you have nice handwriting. I'm um, wishing you both a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year, Jesse. Thanks for being an absolutely amazing and positive influence in this Disney community. Mm, thanks. I look forward to your posts daily and videos. Your outlook on Disney and life is so infectious. Oh, my heart. Thanks for being you. I hope to meet you one day in the future. Oh, yes, we will definitely meet um, next time I'm in Florida. No question. And it says, <laughs> Shantae, you stay. Oh, thanks, babes. <laughs> um, for those of you that don't know, I am obsessed with Drag Race right now. I have been binging Drag Race for the last three or four months, and I've gotten through basically seasons one through seven, and then All Stars one, two, and three. I'm getting ready to start All Stars four, and I've also seen season 11. So I've been doing some intense binging. It is my most favorite, but thank you, Jossum. <laughs> Shantae, you stay too, babe. <laughs> Oh, I love that. You're so funny. And then next is from Serena from Colorado. And there's something in this. I can feel it. There's something else other than a card. Oh, cute. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is Luna Rainbow. Okay. So um, Luna Rainbow is what her YouTube username is. I made a Mickey Mouse ornament for you. I hope that you like it. Oh my gosh, this is so adorable. I love it. So she made me this super cute Minnie Mouse ornament and oh, I love it. Thank you so much. I might put that up year round. <laughs> I love the colors. <laughs> Thank you Luna for always commenting on all of my videos and supporting my channel. It means a lot. So thank you for that. And thank you for my ornament. That's really sweet. So next is from Beverly from Mississippi. And Beverly from Mississippi has sent. It's the most wonderful time of the year. Oh, whoopsies. Ooh, oh cool. There's some Star Wars stickers in there. Uh, Merry Christmas. What love a Disney uh, granny Beverly. XOXO Disney sister. Oh, nice. Oh, thank you so much. That's super sweet. Thank you for thinking of me and thank you for my Star Wars stickers. I love stickers. They are from someone in Illinois. There's no return address. Let's see. Oh, oh, cute. So this is a Mickey Mouse bobble card. I've never seen cards like this. So cute. Wishing you the happiest and merriest holiday season. Thank you for sharing your love of Disney with us throughout the year. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Enjoy the magic and wonder of the season. Merry Christmas, Tara. Thank you so much. That is so pretty. I love that. Well, thank you for watching and supporting the channel. You are amazing.
The next is from Princess Melody. So actually I opened this one uh, because she had mentioned that um, her daughter had created something for me and she wasn't sure if I was ready to open it or see it. And it happened to be a sympathy card for my sweet um, cat, Julian, who passed away over the summer. And, um, oh gosh, okay. So Violet wrote to me and um, said that she thinks that her cat, Ozzy, is playing with Julian over the rainbow bridge. I'm gonna get through this. <sighs> oh, spoiler alert, I didn't get through it. Um, so, she made this picture of Julian and Ozzy. So, that was so sweet, Violet. Thank you so much for sending that to me and thinking of me and creating that beautiful, beautiful picture of Julian and Ozzy. It means a lot. Whew! Isn't it amazing how I cry every video I do like this? So anyway, <laughs> Melody wrote and she says, Miss Cherry, I discovered your channel as a recommended video from Disney Kitty. Thank you for the joy that you've brought to my life. This Your enthusiasm and positivity has done so much for me. Oh, thank you so much. I hope that 2020 <sighs> brings you all of the success and love you desire. Princess Melody. Mm. Thank you so much. Um, and also, I'm going to link her channel down below. Um... And I'm going to not cry anymore. <laughs> I'm going to link Melody's channel down below. Thank you so much, Melody. I, I really, truly appreciate it. Please tell Violet thank you so much. Um, and um, what she drew was absolutely stunning. So thank you um, for thinking of me when I was having a hard time. Oh, the next card is from my friend Lisa. Actually, I have opened this as well. Um, this was a birthday card that she sent me. And it says, celebrating you. And it says, wishing you the happiest birthday and may the year ahead be full of magic and may all of your dreams come true. Thanks for all that you do. Love, Lisa. Oh, thanks, Lisa. I appreciate you so much. You, um, I actually had the opportunity to meet Lisa when I was in Las Vegas last year. She is such a sweet and wonderful person. She also is a huge Olaf fan and I always um, enjoy, she sends me uh, pictures on occasion of her collections and things that she buy, uh, things that she buys that are are Olaf themed and yeah I just really love talking to her so thank you Lisa for my birthday card that's super duper sweet the next card is from Michigan oh yes this is from um Nisha um, Disney 102004 and I will link her information down below but she sent this really super cute card of her in Disney and it's got her and Belle in her Christmas dress and also her and Olaf, speaking of Olaf. And it says, Miss Cherry, I hope you have a great Christmas. Thank you for your wonderful videos. I love your videos about the animals in your home state. <laughs> I hope to visit your home state one day. Well, you're always welcome in Alaska. Be sure to let me know if you visit because I would love to meet you guys anytime you come up because... Alaska is a really cool place to visit. I have uh, tried to meet up with people before that have been on Disney cruises up here. And unfortunately, most Disney cruises don't actually come to Anchorage. So I haven't been able to meet up with people, which is kind of a bummer. Um, but ever, if you are in Anchorage, please let me know. So this next one is from, this next envelope is from Tammy from Florida. Ooh, Tammy from Florida. Oh, this is a fancy. Oh, I just ruined the envelope. Well, that's, I need to get one of those like, what are those called? Envelope openers? Envelope, not envelope cutter. I mean, is it an envelope cutter? Oh, that's nice. May the Lord give you love that warms your heart, hope that lights your way, and joy that fills your home this day through the years with special thoughts of you. Tammy. Oh, thanks, Tammy. That's super duper sweet. Thank you very much. And this card is a beautiful Thomas Kincaid print card. Wow, that's really nice. Oh, thank you. Thank you for watching the channel. This one is from Ohio. I don't know the name. There's not a name on it. Oh my gosh, that's adorable. Oh, it's from Allie. Oh, thanks, Allie. Jesse, it was around this time last year that I discovered your channel. You did a Christmas card swap and I sent you one. This was such a great idea. I've enjoyed your channel and building a friendship with you. 
over the last year. You are such a joyful person. I wish you so much success the coming year. Thank you, Allie. I wish you all of the success as well. This is Cinder Alley Loves Disney, and guys, I'm going to link Cinder Alley's channel down below. Please go sure, be sure and go check her out. She's super, super sweet. I love this little puppy that's on the front of this card. It's so adorable. This is from Taisha, and they put like an envelope around it because I guess it got like really squished. So I hope everything is okay. It's from Taisha in Florida. I'm so worried about this. I wasn't sure if it was gonna be broken. It says, oh my gosh, this is so cool. It says, I love all your YouTube videos, especially the ones at the Disney parks. I'm also a Disney lover. Mickey Mouse and Belle are my favorite. I really enjoy your videos. And on my down days, they make me smile. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. I'm so glad. Um, I wish you a very Merry Christmas and Happy 2020. And um, it says from Taisha. And then she sent me, this is so cool. I don't know what this is, but I'm totally gonna paint it or something. It is a wooden stand-up of Ariel. And it's got these two little feet. Oh, thanks Taisha. I'm so excited to, oh yeah, this is going in my craft room. This is so cute. Ah. Oh. Oh, she looks so pretty too. Sometimes they mess up Ariel's face, but that is a good face. And then this was the card that she sent. Oh, thank you so much. I'm just gonna dig in to, we've gotten through most of the cards. So I'm gonna dig into this card. This card is very bubbly. There's something really fun in this card. Oh, pretty. Oh, cute. Okay, let's see here. Oh, this one is from the Lopez family in Minnesota. And we have a really super duper cute bow that was in the card. Thank you. It's so pretty. I love roses. Roses are my favorite flower. And this says... Oh, this is from G from Minnesota and it says I love your channel. I'm such a huge Disney ear fan. Same. <laughs> I also love Halloween. I was super excited when there was going to be a boo ball. Yes, the boo ball was a lot of fun. I was waiting for you to post. I really want to go to Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party. Oh, I hope you get to go to Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party. Um, I have been to Disney World and Disneyland and I'm going back to the park soon. I was making some bows for my interchangeable ears and wanted to give you one. You're one of my favorite Disney YouTubers. It will probably take a while for you to read this, but I just wanted to say hi. It was fun writing to you. Oh, thank you so much. I so appreciate that. This bow is so cute. I'm going to make it a little barrette so I can wear it in my hair, but thank you. You did such a good job. And I really hope that you get to go to Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party. That, of course, is my most favorite, favorite event that Disney puts on. I'm gonna be there this year, so maybe we will run into each other if you get to go this year. So this next gift is from my friend Joe, who actually lives in Alaska. And it's so funny, I didn't realize um, that this was in here. Joe, you're so funny. It just says, I found this at an antique store in Indiana and thought that you would enjoy it. And this is so fun. It is a vintage Winnie the Pooh pin from 1970. I love vintage D Disney. Vintage Disney is my favorite. And unfortunately, living in Alaska, you don't really get to find a lot of vintage stuff. So when Joe was in Indiana, she found this for me. Thank you so much, Joe. I'm gonna put this, I have a Winnie the Pooh pin board. This is gonna go perfectly on my Winnie the Pooh pin board. Also, it's been a while. We should get together um, for some coffee or something <laughs> or dinner or whatever. This next package is from Charmaine from New York, New York. Oh, valley of plenty. <gasps> oh, <laughs> here I am singing like in between when I cut out. I'm gonna be cutting out some of this video, like where I'm taking off the packaging and stuff. And I'm over here like, oh, valley of plenty, singing the Witcher song. If you guys have seen the Witcher, comment down below. And I literally went, oh, valley of, <gasps> because Charmaine. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Thank you. She sent me. Oh my gosh. It's an Ellie of 700 and it is the 2018 
Father's Day pin from Disneyland Paris. Here is the pin. Look how stunning this pin is. Oh, I do not have this pin. This is amazing. Thank you so much for this pin. It's so beautiful. I cannot wait to add it to my collection. This box is actually from my friend Shelby and it says not a bippity boppity box and Shelby actually has a channel as well. I will link Shelby's channel down below. Um, this one, I have already reached out to her. This was sent to me quite a ways ago, but I wanted to share it with you guys because it's just so awesome. It says, hey girl, hey, I just wanted to send you a gift for reaching 10K on your channel, congratulations. An epic pin might be inside of this box and then inside of this box is so many things. <laughs> so she sent these super adorable stickers. These are actually from Hong Kong Disneyland. They give them out there, which is, oh my gosh, they are so cute. A pop socket of Eric and Ariel, basically the whole Little Mermaid gang. This is actually from a Disney pin creator called Disney Chris, who I really love. Um, I really love being a part of her live Disney pin sales. And then this stunning silk bag. <laughs> it is Gerald as Little Mermaid. This is part of Gerald's World. Uh, it's an Ellie of 50 and this was put together by Disney Pin Dad. I'm going to link his Instagram down below. He has an entire series of Gerald in different scenes from all different types of movies. And this is just the silliest pin. Thank you so much, Shelby, for sending this pin. I... <laughs> I absolutely love it. I think it's so, so, so funny. And then the next gift is from Julianne from Connecticut. And she sent a card that says, thank you. And it says, dear Jesse, just something I found for you in Florida. Thank you for all of your wonderful Disney content. Keep the magic alive. Julianne, a PS, a pic of, pics of what your shirt will look like with color. Oh, cool. Okay, so this is what she sent. So it is a like color your own t-shirt and it's got this beautiful image of a mermaid. It's from Florida and then this is what it's going to look like with color on it. That's so pretty. I'm excited to color this. And then also she sent along a jumbo sticker and it is a scratch and sniff. Oh, I love a scratch and sniff sticker. And this is Ariel and Flounder and the scratch and sniff is watermelon. One of my favorite scratch and sniff smells. You'll have to let me know down below what your scratch and sniff favorite scratch and sniff smell is. <laughs> Thank you, Julianne. That's super duper sweet of you. Send that and think of me. I appreciate that so much. So the next is from Holly from Alaska. So I've also had the opportunity to meet Holly. Holly is a super sweet woman and she created the most amazing thing and I cannot wait to share it with you. And also this card is so cute. I had this made for you. You needed a shirt to wear with those awesome PNK ears. I had this made for me uh, to go with my PNK ears. So back in the summer of last year, I had a video that went up that was a ear swap. And what was so funny about this ear swap is the two people that swapped ears with me ended up giving me the same PNK University ears from, uh, Monsters University. I will link that up above so you can see that video. And this is what she had made for me. Spirit jersey. How cool is that? So it says P&K on the front and it's got these little stripes on the sides. I just think it is so adorable. Thank you so much, Holly, for having this made for me. I love it. I will definitely be sporting that in a video very soon with some P&K ears uh, to definitely show that off a little bit. So thank you for that. Ooh, the next is from a friend in Canada. Her name is Heather. Hello, Heather. Thank you for um, sending me some amazing something from Canada. I love Canada, by the way. Big fan. Big fan. Okay, so this says, 
there are two kinds of people in this world. Cat people and idiots. <laughs> ah! <laughs> ah, love it. Oh, you live in British Columbia? Oh, girl. I love British Columbia. Oh, yay, we're both cat people. She wrote a very long card, and I, I don't know if I want to read all of it out loud. Um, thank you so much for sending me some pixie dust. Purdy's chocolates considered the best in Western Canada. Oh, I love that. Oh, I know. You know, some people have sent beer to Jesse before, and it's worked out, but it's definitely not supposed to be sent through post, so I totally get that. She said that Customs probably wouldn't like her sending beer through the post. <laughs> oh, thank you so much. She was saying that uh, the Little Mermaid is banned in her house. Um, because her one of her eight-year-old friends is uh, terrified of Ursula. <laughs> oh my gosh, thank you so much, Heather. This is amazing. Wow, what a lovely letter. Thank you so much for all of your kind words and your support of the channel. It, again, it, it just, it really means a lot. So thank you for that. Here are some of the Disney adorables that she sent. So we've got Ariel, Eric, Lilo, Max, Scrump, and Stitch. I actually don't have very many adorables. I only had that certain set that was sent to me by Moose Toys and I kind of never really got any more of them. Oh my gosh. So then she sent me these amazing Zoom stickers because there's a lot, so thank you. <laughs> He's so, oh, these are puffy. Oh, yeah, well, I love a puffy sticker. And then she sent this little chocolate tin that has black cats on it and bats and pumpkins. And I cannot wait to try this. Jesse's going to be really excited, too. He's a huge chocolate person. So thank you. This is Purdy's Chocolate from Canada. Never tried it before. So this is gonna be really fun to try. Thank you so much. The next is from Andrew from California. Andrew sent a very stuffed parcel, very stuffed parcel. And I will do my best to try to open it. I put together some, um, some things from Daiso, Hot Topic, and Box Lunch that's either Disney and or Harry Potter related. The feather pin reminds me of either Scuttle. Orville from Little Mermaid Rescuers, the flower is actually a cork stopper from Daiso. And of course the stir spoon reminds me of Harry Potter, Mermaid Lagoon and or the Little Mermaid. A Merry Christmas and Happy 2020. Drew, this is insane. Okay, let's start. I can't even believe all of the stuff that's in here. We're starting with a Disney Wishable that happens to be Ursula. So cool. I love how soft those Wishables are. They are like mooey soft. And then we have two aluminum straws, which is great. Um, we have a complete straw ban in Anchorage and also straw ban in Disney, by the way, guys, if you didn't know. So these, are, I have been using so many reusable straws. Okay, <laughs> let's start here. So we have this really stunning, stunning makeup case that's perfect to like put lipsticks in. And then, oh my gosh, this is so cute. <gasps> oh, I love this. It is a seashell compact mirror. And when you open it, there are two mirrors. What can we see? Oh, you can see my shelving. <laughs> There's so much in here, Drew. I can't even believe this. Next, we have, oh cute, a healing French bulldog keychain from Daiso. That's adorable. We have a drink up skin animated face mask that looks like a penguin. That's fun. Oh, cute. We have a little bag clip that has Mickey on the end. Oh, I love that. I was just telling Jesse that we need more bag clips in our house. It's so funny that you got that. Thank you. And then we've got some washi tapes. And oh, it looks like we have Disney Princess washi tape. And also some Zoom Zoom washi tape. Oh my 
gosh. And then we have all of these pins. Drew, you did not have to do this. I love these. So we have two of the cast member, the cast member name tag pins that are Little Mermaid. We've got uh, Chef Louis at the top, and I believe this is Grimsby, if I remember correctly. Um, so cool. I don't have any of these pins. I have none of the name tag pins at all. And we have a Pizza Planet pin. We have a Sebastian from the Box Lunch Mystery pin set. And an Olaf pin. And last pin, but certainly not least, we have Flounder in a seashell. And that was from 2009. Wow, that's an old pin. We have a wine stopper that is a daisy. That's super cute. A pair of Hogwarts socks. We have this little washcloth. These were very popular when I went to Japan because they don't have paper towels in a lot of their restrooms. And so you were encouraged to take a little towel with you to wipe your hands, which is really kind of interesting. And then we've got two small, like, personal care items. These are so cool. We've got uh, Mickey Mouse tweezers and Mickey Mouse fingernail clippers. Those are cool. Never seen anything like that before. We've got a really fun little set of sticky notes. We've got a couple of stickers from My Little Pony. And then we've got some sticky tags that like go on the edge of paper. One is a princess set and then one is like the Fab Five. Wow, thank you so much. You sent so many things, Drew. Thank you. We have a feather ballpoint pen. This is really cool. That's definitely um, something that reminds me of Harry Potter. Also could be Scuttle. That's for sure. That's for sure. We've got a cocktail, hanging cocktail spoon that is a mermaid. That's super cute. Oh, fun. And then we have two buttons, one of Ariel and then one of Ursula. I've never seen those buttons before. Those are really pretty. I wonder if these are from Hot Topic. There is an art project, a note inspired by the prequel Ariel's Beginning. And it is, let's see here. Oh my gosh, so he has actually made an entire kit for me um, that is the royal banner from The Little Mermaid. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. So here it is. I will definitely keep you guys updated when I get this done. Um, but all of the supplies are placed in here. This is so cool. Thank you. That's so very creative of you. So yeah, I will get working on that and like put it on Instagram so you can see it. And then this is a seashell fan. I love fans. Let's see. Oh, it's so pretty. I don't know if you can see the seashell imprint on it, but there's seashells and bubbles. And then he has sent three mystery packs that happen to be the uh, 30th anniversary figural bag clips. So I'm just gonna snip the bottom of them so we can easily open them up. Oh, we have Max! Oh, cute. So we have Max. Oh, he's adorable. And then next, we, oh, we got Ariel! Yay! Oh, she's holding a really pretty big blue seashell and then last but certainly not least oh we got little baby Sebastian <laughs> look how happy he is oh these are so cute thank you so much Drew you were so thoughtful and put so much into that little nailer that was amazing that was like a Tokyo Kawaii Club on steroids <laughs> My next little box happens to be from my friend Karen from Karen's USA Adventures. Karen had a pin that I wanted to buy off of her, and Karen being Karen wouldn't allow me to buy it from her. Um, so <laughs> I was like, dang it, Karen. 
So when I was in Tokyo, I really, really wanted a King Triton's concert pin. And they were completely sold out of these pins. And Karen happened to be selling one of these pins. And because I am such a huge Little Mermaid fan, huge King Triton fan, I was like, I have got, I do not care how much that pin costs. I have got to have that pin, Karen. And Karen's like, oh, I'll send it to you. I'm like, Karen, no. But then she sent this box, which is much more than a pin, obviously. And if you haven't seen the vlog of this King Triton's concert, I will insert it up above so you can see it and also down below. It was a very interesting concert. I swear it was like Little Mermaid met the Las Vegas Strip. It was so interesting and it was all in Japanese. But we have King Triton, Ariel, and also Flounder and I just am so excited to have this. This was one of the things that I really wanted to get from Tokyo but I wasn't able to get when we went to Tokyo. So thank you so much, Karen for sending that to me. I'm so excited to add it to my collection. The next couple of things, I don't oh, thank you. She just wrote a really sweet card. Have a wonderful 2020, lots of love, Karen and Phil. And look how beautiful that Christmas card is. Oh yeah, oh my gosh, this is so cool. So she told me that she was gonna send me some of her extras of the things that she got that were duplicates of the miniatures from Tokyo. I forgot, this is so cool. So all of their food in Tokyo is so different and so unique. And she got miniatures of some of my most favorite things from Disney. So I'm gonna bring this close to you and kind of show you what it so is. So this is one of their hand burgers. That is actually a ground chicken patty inside of there. One of my most favorite things. You can get this in Toontown in Tokyo Disneyland. And then it also comes with a cup of french fries. Yes, a cup. They serve their french fries in a cup. And this is one of these small little papers that actually goes around your hamburger. And it's from Huey Dewey and Louie's Good Time Cafe. That's exactly where we happen to get this exact. The next thing, oh, I love this so much. It's an actual tray from the Sweetheart Cafe. It looks exactly like the trays that are there. And there is some Mike Wazowski melon and bread and what's wild about this this is the actual detail of the back and what's interesting is when you eat one of these buns on the back it's just wrapped with a thin layer of green over the top and then you can actually see the bun on the inside which is exactly the details that they have done in this not shocking hashtag Tokyo next level and then also here's another pastry that was from the sweetheart cafe I did not try this one but I did have the Mike Wazowski melon bread so cool this is their popcorn bucket the exact replica of their popcorn bucket which we had several of these so neat this is the wrapper to this Mickey lolly ice lolly that they have uh, Tokyo Disney. This one we did not get to try. They're so amazing. I love these so much. Thank you, Karen. I have a full display of Tokyo Disney stuff, and so I'm going to take these out of the package and start placing them into their place over on my Tokyo Disney shelf. Oh, I love that. Oh my gosh, yes. I just realized what this was. Is this really what it is? <gasps> it is. <laughs> So I got a Starbucks You Are Here mug and I was hoping it might have be You Are Here from England and it is. Oh, Karen, thank you. Oh, I was so admiring this and um, because you had sent it to someone else in a swap and I was like, I love that mug. I'm not really generally a mug person, but this was just too cool. I'm gonna take this to work with me tomorrow, but let me show you a close up of the You Are Here England mug. <laughs> I love the coloring, it's so pretty. I hope to someday get to England and come and visit you, Karen. Thank you so much, you are so sweet. And guys, if you haven't already, I'd be shocked, but go check out Karen's USA Adventures on YouTube. Also, she is now doing Primark pickups, which if you guys don't know what Primark is, it is like the ultimate 
store that has all cheap and amazing things Disney and she's doing pickups every single week at Primark, the largest Primark in the UK. So be sure to go and check her out. All of her information is gonna be linked below. Thank you, Karen. Oh, you're so nice, thank you. It's from Sarah from California. And Sarah gave me this humongous box. Gosh. Okay, so there is a card that says Holiday Princess and it's got Ariel. So cute, let's open it up. Oh my gosh, she sent all of these amazing um, princess stickers. It says, as 2019 winds down, I wanna take a minute and thank you. Oh, I hope you and your friends have a very uh, Merry Christmas, thank you. Oh, Sarah, thank you so much. That's super sweet. Thank you for all of your kind words. Thank you for watching the channel. She sent this beautiful lady in the tramp card and all of these really, really cool stickers. Little Mermaid, Aurora, Aurora, is that two Auroras? Yep, Aurora, Cinderella, Snow White, Belle, and Ariel. So let's start. She sent me so many presents. You did not have to do this, but thank you so much. You're so sweet. She, oh, oh, I love this. Oh my gosh. She made me, oh, Sarah. This is so cool. She made me a flying key, you guys. How beautiful is that? Oh my gosh. That is so awesome. Thank you so much. Oh, I love that. That's gonna be so fun. I'm trying to add some more Harry Potter into my Christmas trees because I think there's so many cool Harry Potter things. So this is from her, Sarah and Kevin. Oh, thanks, Kevin. Oh my gosh, this is adorable. Oh, wow. <laughs> This is so neat. This is from uh, the Disney store and it is a Mickey Mouse Christmas ornament where he is Santa Mickey. Oh, that's so cute. Oh my gosh, dual brush markers. Oh, <gasps> dang, these are really, really nice markers. Thank you so much. I have been really into doing bullet journaling lately, so these are gonna definitely be put to good use. <gasps> Ooh, maybe I'll do some artwork with them too. Wow, thank you so much, that's so sweet. And this says, pin mail from my collection to yours. And so there are two pins in here. So we have a Prince Eric as a young child and also a figment pin. And then last but certainly not least, oh, a magic towel. Okay, fun story. I've never done a magic towel and I'm dying to do a magic towel. So thank you. <laughs> this happens to be a magic towel that is Ariel and Flounder. Oh, that's so fun. Thank you so much. And then lastly, we've got this folder and inside the folder oh my gosh <laughs> oh this is so cool so this says from Anchorage to Hogwarts it is my platform nine and three quarters ticket to get on the Hogwarts Express oh this is so cool and then it's got a complete Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry first year student supply list Oh my gosh, this is amazing. So we have the entire supply list. And then I also, yay! <laughs> I've got my letter from Hogwarts finally. <laughs> yay! <laughs> and it's from Minerva McGonagall. Oh my gosh. The term begins April 12, 2020. Well, and it says, I, we are awaiting your owl no later than March 1st. Well, you will be getting my owl, Professor McGonagall. That is so cool. Sarah, thank you so much. This was amazing. You are so thoughtful. Thank you for all of your support for the channel. And I really appreciate all these really kind and sweet gifts.
Next is an unmarked box from someone I have no idea who it's from, but it is an Amazon box that was sent to my P.O. box. So we're gonna find out together. Oh, okay, this is actually from Sarah. Again, it says this was on back order and did not make it into your box. I hope you don't mind I send it separately. Oh, absolutely, that's totally fine. Oh my goodness. <laughs> It's figment and I'm freaking out. Oh my goodness. It is a figment Santa ornament. How freaking cool is he? Oh my gosh, his face is so happy. I love his little outfit and his little wings. The details on him is so cute. Thank you so much, Sarah. This is so thoughtful of you. Oh, I love it. I cannot wait to add him to my Christmas tree next year. And last, but certainly not least, is a box from my friend Christina over at Playdates and Travels. Christina had said she had something for me. She sent this massive box, Christina. Girl. Oh, this card is so cute. Mermaid postcard. It's just a blank postcard, but she sent that. Oh, it's adorable. I want to frame that just black and white style. So cute. Oh my gosh, Christina. What did you send me? Girl. Oh, I love it. So she sent this little winky face. Minnie Mouse. Okay, let's see. Christina, thank you so much. She wrote me this like really long, nice note. I was so sad. We, last time I was in Disneyland, we did not get to meet up. It was really sad. We just kind of like missed each other. And um, with certain annual passes, you have to sign up to like enter the parks on a certain day. And like, we just couldn't seem to to get it to where we could meet each other so I'm so sorry and we've gone so we've gone to Vegas together um, Christina and I we've gone to Disney World together we've had lots of fun times and I just think our schedules have just been kind of crazy and we haven't been able to connect as much as like we should so Christina I totally hear you like I miss you too and I'm so thankful for all of these super sweet goodies that you sent I can't believe you sent all of this when I'm in Disneyland, we definitely need to get together and we need to figure out when next time we're going to the Backstreet Boys show. I would love that. I just had a video call with AJ. He says hi. <laughs> oh yes, okay. So this is kind of where this all started. She sent this to me and said, I feel like you need this notebook. It says, I relate to Ursula on a personal level. Hashtag savage. <laughs> <laughs> yes, girl. Um, I love this. And then the inside is just um, plain notebook paper. It's from a company called Typo, which is, I think it's a British company or maybe it's an Australian company. And then she sent some really cute uh, Monsters Inc. stationery. I love this stationery. It's from Daiso. And I have some Minnie and Mickey Mouse, but this is just adorable and then also we've got oh these are this is really cool we've got some ziploc bags that are so cute winnie the pooh and then i don't know what is this we've got some character gift wrap oh my gosh so you can gift wrap something and make it look like stitch that is a, yes can I just gift wrap the box in my YouTube room and make it stitch and just leave it? Is that okay? <laughs> Next time you guys see me, I'm just gonna be covered in boxes that look like stitch. And then she sent this really super adorable gift bag that has Winnie the Pooh on it. Oh, it's so pretty. We have another gift. Box is adorable. Oh my goodness. Um, excuse me, Chippendale. So cute. Mickey, Minnie, Pluto, also so cute. Look at Susie. Oh my gosh, guys. Look at Susie. Oh, that is so going in my craft room. So in my craft room, in my craft room, I have a window that looks out like where my sewing chair is. This is going in the windowsill because this is, that is adorable. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. It is a piggy bank that happens to be monsters. 
Oh, that is just too cool. America has the coolest stuff. And then, oh my gosh, we have a Winnie the Pooh bag. That is Valentine's Day, or it looks like it. It says sweet as honey. Oh, that's adorable. Oh, oh, that's so neat. We have a flounder cell phone dangle, dongle, dingle dangle. <laughs> We've got a cell phone dingle dangle. We have a Winnie the Pooh. Oh, this is so neat. We've got Winnie the Pooh drawstring bags. You know what this would be perfect for? These are like plastic, so for when you go to the pool and you want to like change, you could slip your swimming suit into this bag. Oh yeah, I'm totally traveling with that. That's so neat. We got some really cool fabric that is Monsters. You know me so well, Christina. <laughs> All of the Monsters stuff. And then a really cool Christmas Winnie the Pooh washi tape. And then last but not least, this beautiful Ariel envelope. And this is um, a pin that she had picked up for me at the Disney Studio Store Hollywood that happens to be flounder with a Sunday. It's Pin Trader's Delight. Oh, I'm so in love with this pin. It is so beautiful. And it's an Ellie of 400. Wow. Christina, thank you so much. We definitely need to connect again soon and chat. Um, I hope you had an amazing, amazing birthday. I know it was your birthday really soon and had a great solo trip to Disney World. Whew, my goodness, I feel, I feel extremely loved. Thank you to everyone who sent something to me, uh, a letter, a gift. I just really, really appreciate it. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. You guys have enhanced my life so much. I appreciate you all. I am so very excited to start putting some of these goodies on shelves. You'll have to let me know down below something that you may have gotten um, as a gift or a note from someone or something that you have given to somebody that really enhanced uh, your life or your daily experience. Um, I feel very humbled and very grateful um, for all of you guys. So thank you so much um, and I hope that you guys have an absolutely magical day and I will see you in the next video. TTFN, bye.